guys, what is up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel, Glam by Sim. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Today's video is going to be one where I'm going to be sharing all of my favorite brow products with you guys. So over the past like two years, I've been trying like a variety of different brow products to see which I like best and what kind of brow I prefer. So right now I kind of have my staple of brow products that I love using and I thought that for today's video it would be helpful to share that with you guys so that if you are looking for some great brow products, you know which one to get or which ones I like. So I have a couple of high-end brow products and then I also have a couple of drugstore brow products that I really enjoy. So if you are curious about my favorite brow products then please keep on watching. So the first thing I want to address, as you can probably tell, my hair is not very pink anymore. So the pink that I always like dye my hair with is a like temporary hair dye so it washes out and now it's kind of like blonde again and I do quite like the blonde as well so I'm really like on the fence about whether I should like make it pink again I think the pink is much more unique I'm not entirely sure what I like better so comment down below if you like me better with blonde hair or with pink hair so I'm going to start with my favorite product at the moment and that is this one and I also featured this in my top five drugstore makeup products video if you haven't seen that I will link it in the description box but this is the elf ultra precise brow pencil and I've been using this ever since I got it every single day that I wear makeup. I've been using this for like two to three weeks now and I really really enjoy it. It's a very like easy to apply pencil. It's not like hard or anything. It's just very easy to apply. So one side comes with like a super precise tip as the name says and then the other side comes with a spoolie which is really nice to like blend everything out. I'm also wearing this on my brows right now. I'm kind of like struggling with my brows a bit at the moment. I'm not like really sure like which shape I want them to be but we'll just have to deal with that for now this is a very good tube for the benefit precisely my brow pencil which is way more expensive than this one I believe this is around six or seven euros and the benefit one is like 28 euros so I think for the price this is definitely a great pencil I have this in the shade taupe which is usually the shade I tend to go for because I don't like it when my brows are like super warm toned so I do really like this brow pencil and I'm definitely going to repurchase this as soon as I run out because it is also so affordable. So another brow product that I really like using but is a bit more expensive is this one and this is from Benefit. This is the Goof Proof Brow Pencil. This does come with more product than the Precisely My Brow Pencil which is like also the reason why I went for this one. So one side of the pencil has a spoolie as you can see kind of similar to the e.l.f. one and the other side has a like twist pencil. So this pencil is thicker than the Precisely My Brow Pencil and so it's easier to fill in your entire brow with it because with the small brow pencils it usually takes quite a bit of time and quite some product to fill in your entire brows whereas with this one it's much easier to apply this to your your entire brow so I do like this I have this in the shade 3 I wouldn't say like I'm the biggest fan of the shade I think it's a little bit on the warmer side for my liking but I still use this every now and then and I think this is a very nice product so then one of my favorite products for like a very natural brow if I'm not wearing like so much makeup I also don't like going for like a super bold brow I usually go for this one and this is the benefit gimme brow brow gel and this is basically like a brow gel with fiber so it fills in your brow it makes them look a bit more like filled in but it's also not super intense and it sets your brows as well so it is a pretty small tube I was kind of surprised about that this is 28 euros but I got this in a set from Boots for Christmas so this is what it looks like it's just a really like tiny brow gel and I really like it because it's super precise and a little bit goes a long way so I do think for the price this is definitely worth it because also for me it's not something that I wear every day if I want to go for like a full face of makeup I usually don't reach for this because it's a bit more of like a natural brow but like I said for days where I'm not wearing as much makeup I do really like this so another thing that I use occasionally is a brow pomade so for quite a while I was using a brow pomade like every single day when I wear makeup but now when I look back at these photos I do like the way my brows look but I just feel like they weren't as natural as when I filled them in with a pencil but the pomade that I always loved using is this one from Morphe this is the Morphe brow cream in a shade biscotti this is sort of like a taupe shade and as you can see I've used this quite a bit I know a lot of people use the Anastasia dip brow however I personally don't like using that because it has parabens in there and I'd rather not use those so this one for me was a very nice alternative and also it's much more affordable this is I believe around nine euros and the Anastasia one is like around like 30 euros I would say 
So this is way more affordable and it does the same thing. This applies super nicely. It's a very like smooth consistency. It's easy to apply. It's easy to blend out with a spoolie. I feel like it doesn't dry out as well. It's still like super smooth. Some brow pomades like dry out really really fast but I feel like this definitely doesn't do that. I, right now I do use it occasionally but I also love using my pencil so I haven't been using it as much but I do really still like it. Then I also wanted to share a brow powder because that is also something I've used for a while and the one I was using is this one from e.l.f. which is the... I'm not sure what this is called, probably like the brow powder in the shade light. So this has a sort of like creamy gel right here and then it has a powder. The powder does look really light but it does apply darker on your brows I feel like. So I really like using this however I wasn't able to create like as clean of a brow. It was usually a bit more messier. That's why I pretty much stopped using this but if you do like using brow powders I think this one is very good especially considering the price. And then the last product I want to share with you in this video is a brow setting gel and that is this one from Benefit. This is the Benefit 24 hour brow setter gel. This is just a very nice clear brow gel. It does the job. It sets your brows into place and I feel like they stay in place very long and it doesn't like get clumpy or something on your brows which is always good. So I really love using this. Also look at my new poster in the back. I got that from Disney. It's so cute. Okay guys and this was it for the video about my favorite brow products. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching it. I would love to hear in the comment section what your favorite brow product is and if you have tried any of these products and what you think of them. I will also want to say if you did enjoy this video then I would absolutely love it if you gave it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell if you don't want to miss any of my videos. All these things would help me so much with my channel and I'd really appreciate it. So with that said I want to thank you guys all so much for watching. I really hope you have an amazing day and I really hope to see you in my next video. Bye!